my name is anil nayar and i strongly believe that in competitive examination it is not about your mathematical and your verbal skills that will be tested any student who is good in reading and reasoning skills will have an edge over the student who is just good in reproducing the formulas and getting the answers in this video i am going to help students to solve aptitude problems through a cube they have never seen before Two thirty plus six whole square equal to four nine two is zero four. Find the value of three into two thirty plus x whole square equal to four nine two is zero four. Find the value of here. See here. If I open the bracket, nine into two thirty plus x whole square. Is four nine two is zero four. If I multiply any number by nine, what will be the digit answer? Nine. If I multiply any number by nine, digit answer will always be nine. Digit answer will always be nine. Right? Suppose then it will be four plus nine thirteen, fifteen, nineteen, nineteen, nineteen. Nine into any number, digital sum is always so, nine. Nine came from where? Three whole square. It is total bracket whole square. Three square is nine. Nine into any number, digital sum is nine. So thirteen, fifteen, nineteen. What is the multiple of nine greater than eighteen? Twenty-seven. So what will be a value? Eight. A value eight. Please write up. Idea clear. Next, second question. Two nine is zero three one into three forty two equal to one double zero nine double zero b zero two. A and b are natural numbers. Find a plus b. Two nine is zero three one into three four two equal to one double zero nine double zero b zero two. Same concept. What is three four two? What is the sum of the digits? Nine. So sum of the digits here nine. If you multiply any number either by nine or any number which has got sum of the digits nine, answer digital sum should always be nine. Nine plus one ten. Ten plus two twelve. So what is the b value? Six. B value six. So after getting B value, see here one double zero nine double zero six zero two. What is the sum of the odd places? Six plus two eight eight plus one nine. What is the sum of the even places? Nine. Mm -hmm. Sum of the odd places. Sum of the odd places equal to sum of the even places. Sum of the odd places. Equal and true sum of the even places. That means number is divisible by eleven. This is divisible by eleven. Is this divisible by eleven? No. That means this should be divisible by eleven. Two nine eight zero three one. What is the sum of the places? Ten. Ten minus of five plus eight. It should be zero. Right? So it cannot be eleven because ten minus some number. What is the divisibility rule of eleven? Difference between odd places sum and even places sum should be zero or multiple of eleven. It cannot be multiple of eleven because ten minus some number will it be eleven? No. So what will be a value? Please write down. 